Oh shoot. What's going on guys? How are we? It's a great day. How are you? It's a fantastic day. Yeah. There's a little snow on the ground nowadays. I like that. That's what I'm used to. You play with four different quarterbacks already this year. What, what, what's it like as a receiver, and what adjustments do you make based on who it is? What, what, take us through what a week looks like as you, as you try to get to know somebody. Um, yeah, I mean, I think, you know, there's a lot of trust in obviously all these guys that we have in that room. And so, um, you know, whoever comes in and steps up is um, is who we go with. And I, I don't think that it changes much as a wide receiver, obviously. I mean, there's some things that each guy does a little differently, but. You know, just kind of doing your job and being able to win, make sure they, they can get the ball out on their steps timing and, and um, you know, winning in the timing of obviously their quarterbacks, their drops, and, um, you know, being able to use that. And so I don't know that there's much that changes besides, you know, I mean, game plan and, and some things like that. But um, with the quarterback, I mean, we like I said, we have trust in all those guys. And so whoever comes in is going to be huge for us. You guys been told who's starting this week? Um, no, I, I don't think we, you know, I haven't heard anything, but, um, you know, like I say, we, uh, we got trust in all those guys. And so whoever it is, is, um, you know, is, is who we're going to ride with and, and who we're going to go full bore with. So what did you see from Mullins on that final drive? Like he connected with you right away, a deep pass. Yeah. I mean, obviously just, you know, stepping in there and, and, and trying to get some confidence with him, you know, I mean, obviously he's a, He's been in this league for a long time and um, has done done a lot of things in this league. So um, I, him just coming in and, and dropping back and just throwing a pass and um, you know obviously it was completed. So that, that was huge um, just for the whole team and uh, getting some confidence, getting some momentum rolling through the last couple drives um, to be able to go down and at, at least score three points and and end the game. You know, so that was uh, that was obviously big for Nick and um, big for the team. So. What about this week? What have you seen in the Cincinnati defense? Um, yeah, I, I think they're a good defense. You know, they got a good D line. Uh, their secondary relies on them a little bit, but um, you know, they got some good good players on that on that side of the ball. You know, so uh, they're going to throw some pressures at us. They, I know they got a lot of nickel pressures, and um, you know, we'll see what they do. I mean, uh, you know, we we've seen we've seemed to scouted some things out, and then they end up doing some different things, and we got to kind of roll on the fly. So. Um, I think, you know, uh, we just got to be open and, and ready for everything that they throw at us and um, just being able to be adaptable on the sideline is, is going to be huge for us. And like I said, it's going to be a great challenge for us. And, you know, they're, they're good defense. They got, like I said, you know, the, their defensive line, you know, we saw obviously a good D lineman last week in, in Crosby and, you know, we'll see, we'll see some more this week. So, um, you know, I, I think it's going to be a good challenge for us and, and we got to step up. Uh, obviously, you got to kind of be a little aware. Um, you know, you you know, we want to play as long as they'll let us. So, um, you, you know, we got to know what we have to be able to do. But as long as you win out and and you win the next game, is you know, then we can control what we can control. So that's that's kind of our mindset in here. Is you know, we don't want to have to rely on anybody. We just want to rely on ourselves. So we gotta we gotta keep playing and and keep playing complimentary football. Obviously, the defense had a great great game last week and. Uh, we relied on them a lot, and you know I, I think it's just week by week on on what's going to happen and how the game flows. And um, you know we we want to control our own destiny. So um, to be able to this this next game is the biggest one. You know and that's kind of our mindset in this locker room is going out and being able to, like I said, control what we can control and and not have to rely on others to be able to keep playing. Honestly, I mean, you know, it, it was tough to go against them in training camp and, and, and seeing what they can do and see what Flo does. And um, there's a lot of ghosts that you got to chase, you know, uh, for them because they're just, they're just so aggressive. They, they, they play their technique and, um, you know, they're able to, you know, still bring pressure and then drop some guys and, and, and only have a five man pressure when it's really, you know, when it's really looks like it could be a lot more. And, and so that kind of just teases people and, and, and does some things that is hard for an offense, you know, to, to have an aggressive defense and um, to be able to make the quarterback come out and, and throw the ball and um, still have lanes closed from, from our secondary and, 
you know, those guys have been balling out, and it's not really a surprise to us. I mean, like I said, we've seen it, and we, we understood what they could do. And so, um, you know, it's it's nice to obviously watch them what, do what they, they've they been doing on Sundays and, and really putting us in some games, um, you know, where, you know, sometimes the offense is slacking a little bit. And so, obviously, you know, it's complimentary football, and that's what we've been playing, um, and which has been awesome. Uh, it, it's been It's been great to see. Um, and be able to rely on a defense. Did you uh, happen to see Kelsey's play? Or was that plant the seed as a tight end? <laughs> Instead of looking around to see who's open. Yeah, that was uh, that was pretty wild. Obviously, you know Travis is one of those one of the great tight ends in this league, and um, will obviously go to the Hall of Fame. And yeah, that was an insane play. I was I remember getting on the plane and I saw it and I was like, oh my gosh, um, you know, just to. Obviously, have the confidence to do that with with the time and and everything, and then um, to be able to just throw a dime like that um, to that wide receiver was insane. So, uh, obviously, it got called back, but um, you know, still a great play and still something that they should always uh, show for sure. Jenna, it can be tough in the moment, but have you taken any time to? Have you? Th- <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's muse for you. Yeah. Have you taken any time just to, to consider how unusual the quarterback turnover has been for you guys this year, you know, starting with the Packers game and just almost on a weekly basis, just different people or uncertainty and all that. And just no matter who they are or how they're playing, it's just different. Yeah. Um, no, I haven't really gotten a, st- uh, a chance to step back and obviously look at that. I, that's not something that we'll do until the off season, really. You know, I mean, uh, when you're in it, you're in it, and, and each guy. I mean, we've we've had we've had injuries this year. I mean, that's just a, a a prominent thing in football. I mean, something that you you go through each year, and sometimes some years are better than others. And you know, obviously this year we've had some guys need to step up, and and that's what they've done. Um, you know, we've we've continued winning games with who who's out there, and um, you know that's what we're we're going to continue to do. I mean, um, see, like I said, we got trust in all these guys in this locker room, whether. Um, you know, they're a 10 year starter or a rookie coming off no starts. You know, we got confidence that they're going to come in and make a play. So, um, with, with the quarterback situation, obviously, um, you know, that's a leader of our offense. And so, um, you know, we, like I said, we have trust in all those guys. And so when they come into the, the huddle, they, they've each, every single one of them has had confidence to come in there and, and throw the ball and, and, um, be able to do what their job is, which has been, like I said, incredible. So. Um, not something really I've, I've looked at, but um, you know, something that we we're, we've been able to come through and, and continue and will continue to do. So, cool. I appreciate you. you guys. Thank you. Thank you.